<laughs> oh goodness. Kind of. There we go. That should do. No, oh, I should. Well, that happens. We're playing trains, the video game. Hold on. I might have to take on a break. No. What, Twitch? Go with that, just because I'm a baby. Aim assist. Let's, let's just leave it how it is. I think that'd be smart. Chorister bees will always attack if you're carrying chorister and nectar. Good to know. Don't mess with bees. My chat box is a little huge. Let me uh, reduce. No, that's there. This one. Log of Her Majesty's Locomotive, the Orpheon, March 14th, 1905. Our expedition to the domains of the dead has been eventful. The Orpheon is damaged and in grievous need of repairs and supplies. We are returning in haste to the Reach, where I hope to make port in New Winchester. May God be with us, for a thousand deaths wait in the sky. Final entry of whatever ship exploded that we're going to go find. We're playing Sunless Sea 2, which I have not played here simply because I played it many ages ago. That's definitely a helpful feature. Oh, I didn't read that last one. Oh, whatever. Your journey back from Blue Kingdom was tumultuous. Your locomotive is damaged, and Captain Whitlock is badly wounded. Well, Captain Whitlock, you're gonna die. I just crashed. <laughs> As first officer, the crew look to you. The nearest station is New Winchester. Can you get the Orphean there safely? Well, I just crashed, so probably not. Cruise control. Cruise control? Can't do that on a boat. Can't do that either, apparently. I got some fire. Much to the relief of your stokers, you find a barrel of fuel among the detritus. The Aussie men need this. The wreck drifts here, less fortunate even than you. We should scavenge out for repairs, a crewman says. Hello. Don't mind my bad accent, one person I see in the corner. The wreck hangs in the sky, poked with recent gunfire. Poked? Pocked. I'm stupid. You and the boarding party don your sky suits, garments of waxed canvas lined with lined with felt to protect against the cold of the sky. Two of the crew are whispering as they dress. What business did Captain Whitlock have in the Blue Kingdom anyway? Why the devil did we trespass in the districts of the dead? You silence him. Now is not the time. Leap across the gap. The gap. Gap. You jump. Your stomach lurches with the vertigo as the stars blaze above you and below. The air of the heavens is thin, torn by unpredictable winds. Then your boots hit the running board of the Ozymandias, the Ozzy Osbourne, and you, you can't read. <laughs> I picked a reading game. I cannot read. And your leather-gloved hands fumble for a hold. One of your companions throws you a line. And you lash the two and en 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 engines together. And en engines. Am I that stupid? <laughs> Only then do the rest of the boarding party follow you. One of them forces an exterior hatch open, and you clamber inside. His her interior is cold, unlit, and whistles with the wind. Your party lamp spreads buttery light over the marrow, paneled passages. 
You make your way towards the hold, stepping over bodies crumbled in the corridor. Unfortunately, your way is blocked, as it always is. A bulkhead has met had a bulkhead has been man mangled inward by a well aimed barrage. So we can either break in or go around. I'm gonna break in. I failed! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, someone died! <laughs> As you strain against stubborn steel, you remember an event from a year ago. A boiler explosion had trapped an engineer beneath a tangle of plating and pipework. The captain was first in the scene, you were second. Together, you pried the wreckage upwards, enough for you to crawl beneath it, while the captain braced the bar across her back. By all means, take your time, she grunted as you dragged the engineer out. Back in the present, the twisted bulkhead yields. Suddenly, a crewman cries out as its jagged edge bites him. He gets chopped in half and dies. Congratulations, you're a terrible captain. Uh, you've reached the Ozzy Osbourne's hold, a ruin of smashed car carge board? cargo. And supplies, sub, sp spilled supplies, I swear. Hopefully somewhere amidst the detritus, you can find parts to repair the Orphean and restock your stores. Well, we only have one option. Search thoroughly. Supplies and hull. You find enough food and gear to restock your supplies, and enough spare parts to make necessary repairs to the Orphean. The food will need to be thoroughly thawed, of course, but you've eaten worse in the skies. Oh ho! cries one of your party, prying the lid off a long crate. It holds a cannon, sweet, still nestled in the straw. Another crewman pulls a battered bird cage from a pile of ruined cargo. With it, with, within the cage, something winged and furry opens a sullen, a sullen eye. One day I'll learn how to read. Need a different bat. Okay, uh, Ozzy Osbourne meets a long, juddered, jud juddering creak. Your boarding party exchanged nervous glances. From the chaos of its hold, you have retrieved repairs and supplies, discovered some useful equipment, a gun and a bat. So we can mount the Jerusalem onto the Orphean and get the bat. Well, either way, we're getting both things. I want the cannon. It's called the Jerusalem. Okay. I now have a dividend bet. Uh. Okay. Ozzy Osbourne emits a long, juddering creak. Your boarding party is nervous. Uh, crap could be broken. Should we keep going? Yes. The wreck of Ozzy Osbourne screeches as its metal buckles and tears. You press on the shuddering corridors, searching frantically for the engine room. Let's go myself. Hey, I lived! Sweet! F to send out my bat. Well, my bat just flew off into the galaxy. What'd you get? Open my chart? What button is that? Well, I can now fire a cannon. Where's- what's the button for- there it is. Okay, so that's probably where- oops. That's probably where we're headed, it's right there. The walls of the captain's cabins are lined with a hodgepodge of curios from across the sky. Captain Whitlock is dead. Black marks cover her skin like a monstrous brand. When she coughs, coils of acrid smoke pour from her lungs. That's why you should have quit smoking. It's bad for you, you know? Inquire after the captain's injuries. I'm doing this unconsciously. <laughs> um... Let's try to be cool. Her mouth is blistered from the blue fires that danced on her that dance on her tongue. Her hand grips your arm. 
Her skin is hot as a kettle. Made arrangements. The Orphean will be yours. Her voice is just rasp of burned meat breath. But promise. She breaks off to scream and... She breaks off to... She breaks off to scream a word and language that was not made for human mouths. When she resumes speaking English, she's weaker. Her request little more than a gasp. Promise me one last service. What's up, Cap? She sinks back, relieved. All in my will. Be a better. She breaks off as the sigils burned in her bones flare, glowing cherry red through her flesh and skin. Captain than I am. I'm assuming she's like, <coughs> doing this whole thing, but I'm not going to do that. <laughs> the effort exhausts her, and she is dead. You leave the captain and the scorched stink of its air behind, and return to the bridge. New Winchester is further than you'd like, and the captain hasn't long left. How much ammo do we have? I'm afraid. Oh no! Okay, uh, oops. Ooh, cool, it dropped stuff. Yes, please. Raid them. Money! I like money. That was the wrong one. No! I'm assuming we're heading that way. I'll come back to you. And that's, that's where I'm supposed to go. Bancroft's forum. Scout discovered something. It's a track. Is this new Winchester? Oh gosh. Hey! It is. Our captain isn't dead yet. You coast into the bustle. You, yeah, you coast into the bustle. The din, the soot, and the steam of wolves' 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 station. I'm not English. It is clogged with other engines, scrappy mining locomotives from Lustrum Way. Weathered explorers gleam with frost. Sleek company vessels with bright brass fittings. No sooner have you pulled into the sidings than a brusque station master bustles over. He requests to come aboard. I must speak with your captain. He insists, brandishing a ledger. The usual formalities. Uh, our captain is currently turning into a skeleton. I don't know if that's the right phrasing. The crew exchange a bleak, wordless look. The Orphean itself feels suddenly more empty. The station master looks confused. You inform him that, unfortunately, Captain Whitlock has just passed. Ah, he says, neutrally. Sorry to hear that. Very sad, very sad. He waits for what he considers to be an appropriate minute and a half before continuing. Alas, even amidst tragedy, the cogs of bureaucracy must turn. If Captain Whitlock is deceased, the station authority requires their answers from the first officer. He dons a set of spectacles and opens his pen. It will be relatively painless. Name, background, purpose, visit, visit, etc. Shall we begin? And... Now we're entering character creation. Oh! There's more here than there was in C. Hey, a Zaylor. The Z. Okay. Today London lies between the stars. Her new empire unfolds across the heavens. But ten years ago, before the Northern Gate was opened, before the renewed Empress led her people to the skies, it lay a vast cavern far beneath the earth. Deep, dark, marvelous. Who were you then? Stealing stuff, killing people, writing hentai, 
learning stuff. Hymns. Sailing the Z. The Administratum. Killing everybody. Hmm. Oh. High fails. Skill of evading. Thing with high iron. Skill of damage. Okay, so good dex, good strength, good charisma, good intelligence, good wisdom. Oh no, still good charisma. Good strength. Good that's good wisdom. And good dex. Okay. Let's right hand side. Uh, create your captain. You were a poet. Poetry was popular in old London. Some poets sought fame, others art. Some simply enjoyed bohemian company. Three preeminent artists' movements come to prominence. Which of your works, or which are your works most associated with? <laughs> I think I have to go with this one. Uh, increases veils. Uh, increases, increases wisdom, increases dex. Increases strength. Let's go with dex and delight in darkness. She's an ambition. The truth. Oh shoot! Like legit character creation. Okay. Take off hats for a minute. Take off everything. No brows. I have no chin. Term of address. Professor. Officer. Archivist. Principal. Administrator. Secretary. Intendant. Nurse. Comrade. Brother. Sister. Madam. Sir. Citizen. Captain. My lord. My lady. Specialist. Doctor. Professor. That's Mr. Doctor. Professor. Man in a gigantic coat. Let's go with Archivist. That sounds cool. Name? Venus? No. Uh, Chippo. 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 I have lots of charisma. Let's go. Three weeks have passed. This morning, Captain Whitlock received a simple memorial service. Her body was consigned to a necropolis train bound for the serene mausoleum. I will buy stuff. Now you visit. Now, blah, blah, now you sit with a handful of her relatives in the threadbare offices of her solicitors. A, metho a methodical, a metho a methodical notary is reading the will. As Kermit, I could probably read better than as me. The captain was wealthy once but squandered her capital on mysterious expenses before her expedition to the Blue Kingdom. Listen to the end. The captain's relatives, for whom she was mostly estranged, are clearly wondering why you are here. Because I'm cool. In a final cod codicil, the notary announces, Captain Whitlock confirmed the possession of the Orphean was to pass to its first officer. He peers at you with dry gray eyes. This includes a certain black box contained within the Orphean's hold. Captain Whitlock's final request was that, at a time of your choosing, you transport said box to an address in London. He hands you an address card and deposit it there. You are not to look inside. She gave no explanation. It's her Dogen collection. And that's it. 
You're the captain. Look at me! I'm the captain now. Captain Whitlock's legacy. You can investigate the black box at New Winchester. Or you could sell it and be done. I'm gonna take it to London. I'm, that sounds like a fun adventure. I don't know where the hell London is, but... And I got a hundred bucks. Cool. Okay. Okay. Uh, before you leave New Winchester, it may be prudent to buy more supplies. You can visit them at Victoria Market. To visit the market, select it from the menu that appears to the left of the main panel. Here, swap between shops and stories. Cool. Uh, let's see, I have seven people. I kind of, that's fuel. Oh, this is upgrades. Okay. That's cool. Uh, I don't think I need anything. Who sells fuel? There's fuel. 20 shillings each. That's okay. Uh, your hold is almost full. Okay. Which button is hold? H. Fuel and supplies. Supplies we can do without. Uh, we need gas to drive. Back up. Jump the gun there. Where the hell is London? I need a map. Take me to London. I don't know what to do with it. I'm not gonna read all of that because it's basically specific just in London. You could find someone willing to purchase it as a curiosity. I want to take it to London. Where is London? Pick the lock yourself. I don't have enough uh, veils. You need a savage secret. I had it brought on board just before your ill fated expedition to the Blue Kingdom. So we went to Lichland and then our captain died, and now I have to take this box to London. Perhaps not. Explore the city. How goes the war? Slow, bur Slow burning war for the Reach forms the backdrop in daily life in New Winchester. Citizens wishing to keep up the development of the war turned to the New Gazette. It is, famously, the only newspaper worth reading in New Winchester, as well as the only paper that hasn't bankrupted itself. Its quality speaks for itself. Here you can read about the progress of the war. Um... What's going on in my world? Your name does not appear, because I'm not cool enough right now. Um... Gee... Can I buy a map? I guess I can just explore. Mascot? We'll do that later. Let's get to more driving boats.
Um, what's up here? Big lighthouse. One percent terror. A distant clamor of the engine yards, an accretion of smog on the windows. Ooh, a two percent terror! Oh no! Nobody is here. <laughs> What's this? Uh, there's a meter next to. Me. Whoopsie! I shot a rock. Alexander Yang claim. Oops, I'm stupid. Okay, I think we're gonna have to go around the other way. Oh gosh, I do not know how to drive. Gentlemen? We uh, we good? I don't I don't want to just open fire. No oh, music's happened. Actually, I don't know if this is. I'm not seeing it because I have it really low because it's deafening. There you go. Just be condensation trails across the sky. The ghosts of passing trains. Eee. I'm not so good at train piloting. Is my terror going up? 6% terror. Uh. Local headquarters of the Windward Company. London's proxy in the reach. Okay, how do I get to the London? <laughs> Tell me! <laughs> they have work for a Skyfarer. Ooh, a quest? Yes, please. The offices are cramped. Typewriters ring. Assistants scurry between decks. Beleaguered managers struggle to make themselves heard over the hubbub. Eventually, a harried assistant makes you a cup of tea. I'm afraid everyone's- I'm not doing an accent. Afraid everyone's busy today. But if you want to make yourself useful, we always need updated reports on the events beyond New Winchester. Bring them straight here, not to, he nods out the window towards Victory Hall, where the Colonial Assembly gathers. That lot. Queen and country and all that, eh? As you visit ports, obtain port reports, bring them here. Gotcha! Uh... Shops? You have no shops. Boo! You have nothing interesting for me. Look at my chart. Okay, there's Victory Hall, there's Company House. There's New Winchester. Okay, but this is like a dead end, so I kind of need to go out that way. I guess we're going this way. Let me talk to these guys. Unless I keep crashing and die. Or my terror keeps going up. The Assembly. Coalition of independent-minded settlers called Tacities. Gather and argue. Here, deliver port reports to receive rewards and Tacities. Visit Victory Hall. Hi, friends. Take a look around. What happened to your face? You get attacked by a werewolf? A werewolf? I don't know. Uh, today, the company, the, the company, the chambers of victory echo with shouting. The assembly is in session and outraged roar, 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 descends from the boardrooms with a palatial lobby. Maybe tonight wasn't the best night to read a billion things. 
I'm not so good at the reading. Out loud, at least. You're a captain, aren't you? She inquires, once you're safely outside. If you want to be of service, bring us news from other ports. Okay. So I can pick these dudes, or the other dudes, who I don't know any difference. Boop. Yep, that's what I thought would happen. Oh, it's the... The gray is the ocean. The white. No. Yeah, the... The white is the solid. Nope, that was wrong. I know! <laughs> It's gonna be that one, right? Yes, center myself a little bit. Chippo. Nope. Let's leave this vortex. This is a vortex, get on your knees. The calm before the storm. I don't remember any other words for that song. F. Find me something, Mr. Bat. What'd you find, boy? Holy crap, okay, we're going there because we have nothing else to do. As I currently have no quests other than figure out how to get to London. What's this doing? Old stones and far, uh, forgotten ruins lie tumbled across the sky. We found a destroyed earth. Ruins claw the sky, the work of giants. Like legit giants, or are we talking like, these are the kingdoms of old? I leveled up. Okay. Oh, uh, take a facet. Okay, I could go to jail. I could get famous slightly. Affiliation with alcohol or some candles. Scarred. Interlude in red and gold. You lost your mind once. They put you in a splendid honed hotel managed by a cheery gentleman who would determine when you could leave. A scandal. Let's go with a scandal. That sounds fun. A parade of debauchery. I didn't even have to read that. I know exactly what I want <laughs> my character to be. <laughs> Oh, poop, I passed it. I know. Literally just hitting buttons right now. Discovering ports. I did. 
significantly reduced your terror. Okay, that's helpful. Behold, a ruin of giants. Gargantuan blocks jigsaw together furred with moss and whispering with or orchards. A blog <laughs> bucolic? What are these words? I'm just a stupid American boy. I'm not like a cool Englishman. Despite the fact England is basically America of Europe. Uh, smoke coils daintily from the chimneys. A leisurely game of cricket unfolds in the village green. Disembark. Port Avon. Doesn't Avon just mean river? Uh, an oily-faced, black-haired girl waves your locomotive into position. Welcome to Port Avon, she calls as you disembark. A rich nod of sense greets you. Leaves and little leaves and wood smoke. Not leaves and wood smoke. That's like leave, like leaving. Ah, uh, enriched by an infrequent and pungent intrusion of goat. Your novelty will wear off the more time you spend here. Oh dang, they get bored of visitors? What if I'm cool? That's rude. Uh, write a report report? Why not just call it a report? Okay. He's recruited the repentant devil. Onwards! Shops. Bazaar? No. Supplies! Oh, where's my money? Do I not have much? Where are my shillings? I don't have any money. Oh dang, I need to do some quests. Stories. Go here. Do this. You're wearing a true welcome. <laughs> Attend church. Okay, fine, I'll leave. These petulant bastards. Uh... One of your crew, one of your crew, but the deceased is no one you know. A stranger on your locomotive. Peculiar luggage you brought on board, says one of the crew, when some of the others have gathered. Wouldn't have thought it fit for your- wouldn't- wouldn't have thought it would have fit in your little bag. First, clean up. It won't do to leave the body in the hall. Then, the, rep the repentant devil can re explain himself. He's still got the blood on his cuffs. Who is he? Why'd you kill him? He was a stowaway, explains the devil indifferently. He's been stalking me for more than a month. Thought I'd lost him when I came aboard. Then he turned up in my quarters. From the body, he's lifted up a clinking bag of souls? Is this Dark Souls? He just has souls laying around? Perhaps he was sent to bribe me rather than kill me. He tilts his head to consider the soul collection. Apparently thinks I'm a cheap hire or so. The devil's gaze reverts to you. I regret to say this. This is probably not the last time this happens. I may be destined to attract negative attention. Okay. How's my soul looking? It's not worth much. Too flawed. I could, too flawed? Oh, it's okay. I understand. That's all I need to know. Uh, what do you, what do you, what do you, what do you, what are you, what are you expecting? What are we thinking here? He laughs at when approached. Oh dear, a little obvious, perhaps. 
His gaze is amused and flickers with intensity. I have an idea that might be beneficial for us both. I'd like to improve the lives of the workers at the Home Office in Abbott Horizon. If you don't mind permitting me a little shore leave. The devil will generate new prospects at the Abbott Horizon if placed on a second mint there. Okay. Where's that? This is really cool, but I don't know if I'm feeling this right now. I'll give it another 15 minutes or so. It's like I could absolutely get into this, but this might not be a stream game. It might just be... Ate too much food. Want to chill. Play this. Oh, I could make him an officer. He's my signaler. Spoopy. Careful, Captain, the junior signaler says. I've lost friends to the marauders who hide in the woods. Not if I'm a master of ocean combat, and by ocean I mean trains. I'm aware. Crash. That was stupid. Oh no, I broke my car. I won. Screw you. I need to go fix my train. Oh no! <laughs> Victor, the spoils. Ooh, yes! The crew wrap the sky-maddened captain in blankets and secure them tightly with belts. It takes four to transport him safely to your locomotive. He might not be happy restrained, but it should keep him from harm until you get to Magdalene's. Cool. 23 Sovereign. Uh, where is... Where is Magdalene's? I got something. Where is... Is this... Hold on, tab. Okay, so whenever we get to Magdalene's, we'll deliver that guy. What's up, Hugh and Masco? How's it going? I'm, uh, just piloting a train. Probably going to die, as I'm bad at trains. Let's see. Prepare to board the wreckage, poised to plunder the plunderers. Behind you, someone's humming a song of victory. Always roll dice. I failed! 
I have one uncanny specimen. It broke something. It didn't work very well. Cool. Um, why is there a manatee there? You good? Yep. Cool. We're good. I saw you when you're playing Lobotomy Corporation. Forgot to ask, how can I call you? Call me? How so? What do you mean? Oh, uh, I died. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> like chips? Yeah, like chips. Okay, this time I'll go with a sailor. Explored the truth. Done, we're a nun. Secretary Hilbrick. The game with some eldritch ambiance. Nice. Wait. What's a Zaylor? Oh, uh, this is... Have you ever heard of the game Sunless Sea? This is the sequel. Kind of. And I do not know what I'm doing. Somehow... This is Winchester, apparently. Where's my, my map? Here it is. Uh, I need to take a box from here to wherever the hell London is. And I don't know where that is. This is gonna be a doozy, right? What's in my hole? Do I have any? I have eleven dollars. See, is this an enemy to break? No, he left. No, he's he's good. He's normal. also crashing into that rock. I'm guessing you have to manage your resources and no heads. Yeah. For the most part, at least. There are kind of only two resources, thankfully. So fuel and supplies. And I guess crew. And how much cargo you can hold. And sanity. There's a little bit to manage. This close to the mother of mountains, the sky grows cold. Your crew dons coats and gloves. Ah, uh, yeah, sanity. Sanity is always an interesting game mechanic. Unless they put it in poorly. Bonnie Shepherds. Did I discover a thing? No. Just some rocks. Stairs, looks like. He looks friendly. That means he came from a place.
Maybe not. Oh, that's how I do it. Oh, I'm stupid. I need to go back to New Winchester. But I'm already going this way, so I'm going to see what's up here. Fill out the map. Whole ruins are locked in the ice. There's staircases leading nowhere. I had a friend who climbed one of the stairs. Didn't come down again, though. Okay. Oh, they have magic! Oh, cool! And their hands are bulletproof. And I'm bad at games. Die! Well, it looks like they're, they might be bad at games, too. Bulletproof. Nope. Yeah, I figured that would happen. Why is Baba Yaga in, I'm assuming, Norse ruins? Ow. If London is south of us. Well, if Winchester is south of us. Where is Winchester? Okay, I'm not doing so hot anymore. Oh no! <laughs> Oops. Well. I got this and five bucks. Incredible. Let's go with Soldier. Perfect. Adam Flanagan. Incredible. Here, you. Tell me things. Give me a quest. Aw. I don't have money for a sign-on fee. What am I doing now? Meet at the Promise of Days in New Winchester? Where is that? Probably reading half of this. But who wants to read in this game about reading? Just keep clicking on stuff. Every time you died in the Sunless Sea, you had a bonus. You have that here too? I don't think so. I should be reading this, but I'm too lazy. <laughs> This is the tutorial. I just want to fly my train around, to be honest. The letter. I'll do that later. I want to f try to find London. Let's see, we went north la- oops. We went north last time and died. This way. Nope. This one. Oh crap, it didn't save uh, that, I guess. Yeah, we hadn't been to a fort, so. Tutorial? 
Choo choo, mofo. Exactly. I can learn later. Oh, they got a full crew, which is interesting. Oh yeah, because I died. Oh no. That's the best feature. Some will see you running into something, you just died. Here. Whispy condensation trails across the sky. Ghosts of passing trains. Okay. You have better control. You really do. It's so nice. It really makes you feel like you're flying a train through space. Wait, the south is cold too? Oh no. Hey, what's up? Welcome to trains. I crashed. Sky closes its cold jaws about you. Water freezes in the pipes. Engineers scurry to and fro with boiling kettles. This person's like, who are you? Uh, not any your business. crashed into one of them. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Again, it's the wrong button. I have an idea, and that is go to the edge of the map and do a big circle. That's probably really stupid, but before I do like big quests, I kind of want to know where I am. And it'll save on my log so long as I get to a dock beforehand, or before I, you know, die. Hooray, I lived. What do you drop? I'm not gonna risk it, I just want the money. Okay, we're nearing the bottom, but there's diamonds, apparently? Is that what this is up here? I saw something that looked relatively shiny. Oh no, I have no mining drill. Poop. I'm just a useless train, train in space. It wants me to mine. I didn't know we were playing Minecraft.
that looks like the edge. Sort of. As far as it'll let me at the moment. Although I guess the real question is how long will these last before I uh, kick it? I'm not playing this game how it's supposed to be played. Ooh, stuff. What do I get? Some hull strength, I think is what that is. Find me something I can park in, bat. I don't think he has bullets. Thank you, random friend. But the loot is mine, you can't have it. Hooray! I can now fly for a lot longer. Is he after me now? Or is he just dumb? I passed that, but... A homestead tucked away in the quiet corner of the sky. Doc! Hey! Crockery? I found a tea kettle. Is that what... Nope, I opened something on another screen. Oh, poop! You're not really very good at killing, Mr. Tentacle Monster. Oops, I said that. You immediately hit me. I hope you have some supplies. Stop flying away from me. Please die. Who died? Three people died. And we're now spooked. We have become spook. Spookology. The study of being spooked. Is there a dock nearby? I really hope there is. The audio design in this game is fantastic. I hope I can go over this. An uninvited guest. A stoker has discovered a creature wrapped in, wrapped affectionately around his Toby jug. Good from his aunt. Oh. Uh, the creature is as long as your arm. It looks like a leech bred with an eel. 
to one of the guests. Oh goodness. Kill it. Some guests have arrived. The quality is gone. You have guests aboard. Let's dock at the nearest station and let them out. To wreak havoc upon whoever the hell owns the place. Hey! We lived! Okay, at least nothing. I was just clicking to click. Do I have money? No. Wait, I can't- do I have- I thought I had some stuff. Yeah, I have this. I guess they don't want that, though. Uh... Now we're gonna die. That's okay, because now we have this all saved. Then we can start back in New Winchester. Is this the strat? It's just death run captains until you have the map filled out? I don't think that's how the game is meant to be played. What if I kill that guy? Oh crap. <laughs> that was a mistake. Oh. Oops. Space has kill. Not all is lost. We start at level one. That's okay. Maximum dodging. Done. Boop. Now how much of it did it save? Actually a lot. Okay, cool. So, it still begs the question, is where the hell is London? Wait, do I still owe that debt? No. I'm pretty sure that's almost- yeah, it is. Hmm. Oh wow, there's quite a lot. Hmm. This game is cool. Save and exit. I can only do that on a port, I'm assuming. I can leave. Boop. <laughs> now what am I doing? That game is cool, but I'm not really feeling it. Hmm.
uncertain. <laughs> have an idea. Question is, how long will it take? Yep, that's what I was afraid of. <laughs> This was a shorter one, but I think I'm just going to end it here. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by, my friend. <laughs>